Uh, good, good win for us. I, I didn't think we played great. Give William and Mary credit. They made it hard on us, uh, turned us over. We had 16 turnovers. That's more than we've had in a conference game all year. Uh, but I thought we had some guys play well. I thought uh, AC had a heck of a ball game. I thought Mido had some, some big time defensive plays and Fitz was really good on offense. So we got a lot of production from our post guys. Um, and uh, Jared Fry was good. So we were able to pull it out and uh, happy to win at home. Uh, you know, good crowd on a Saturday afternoon. Well, the momentum's important, and and you know you hate losing on the road, but I mean one of them was was Monmouth, who's fourteen and one at home, so it wasn't like we lost to uh, you know uh, a, a high school team in their own building, like you know. So these games are hard, man. All these league games are hard. If you don't play well, you cannot win. If you play well, you could lose close. I mean, they're just a lot of good teams, and um, William and Mary is has been kind of ravaged by injury. And I give them credit. Their schedule in February has been really hard. Uh, if you were to go look, um, we were the lowest team in the standings that they've played, and we're 9-7. and seven. So they've had kind of a, a really rough month with who they drew. Um, and, uh, and, 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 but momentum is always important. I, I, I like where we're at. I thought we were just awesome on Thursday. I thought we played at a high, high level. I didn't think we played at a super high level today, but enough that you win by double figures at home in a conference game, you know, that you're going to take that in any day of the week. So uh, hopefully the guys are feeling good, you know, going on the road to Drexel. And then with William and Mary being a relatively poor side from a statistics point of view on offense and defense, how did you look to exploit them on both sides of the floor on offense and defense? Today? Well, they're hard to guard because they shoot so many threes. Like they took 35 threes. So anytime you do that, uh, the floor is really spaced, and um, they, they've, uh, you know, Williams, their starting five man who shoots 37, 38 percent from three, is out with a concussion, so it changes their lineup. And um, you know, Dorsey was uh, was made a couple; he was two for eight, uh, but we were able to, you know, catch him on an off night, which was was helpful. Well, yeah, you know what? I, I, I thought they missed some good looks. I didn't. I thought our defense was okay. Um, you know, I, I didn't think we were great. Now we held them to 62 points, and obviously they didn't shoot good percentages. I, I, I see the stats, but they had some looks that were, were were decent looks that they just missed. And I think that's that's always part of basketball. You know, you got to make shots. You can run a great play, guys wide open, it doesn't go in. All of a sudden, it's not good offense. Um, you can play really good defense. Aaron Clark hits a step back jumper on you. It's not bad defense, but it's bad defense statistically. So, you know, sometimes what you're watching and what the numbers are don't always add up. And I didn't I don't know that we were near as good as the numbers defensively today, but um, but all that said, you know, still very happy with the result. And then Aaron, you've had a great performance driving to the basket and some focus in the game today. So the tribe is a team that lacks big and they play a relatively small ball system. So what opportunities um, I mean, they didn't have too much shot blocking out there like Coach Hill without their uh, starting center. So, I mean, I just tried to get down the lane and be aggressive. I know they got bigger guards, but I just tried to play off two feet and go up strong and finish at the run. Gotcha. And then the team is going on both ends of the court today. So from an offensive perspective, how are you guys able to get each other so many good looks and be so consistent in the um, I think transition helped a lot. I mean, and then we played off. We played off Fitz and Mido in the post, and I think transition we got a lot of good looks. And I know in the half court we got some um, staggered threes for Tyler. So I think if we just keep moving more, I feel like we're a little stagnant today overall. And I feel like if we just keep moving and cutting, we can do what we did tonight.